Hey everyone, this is Gene and I'm a graphic designer and illustrator for about the last 15 years and today we're going to show you how to make collage wall art from a magazine. It's going to be awesome. Let's get started. Alright, so this is one of the easiest ways to get a bunch of use out of your old magazines. If you don't just want to throw them away, because in some magazines uh, there are some really good photos and someone spends a lot of time picking out all these individual photos for each magazine. Like this one is fantastic. Look at this guy. He's just playing an ironing board, kind of like an air guitar. I don't really even know what he's doing, but let's say I want to preserve this guy with his air guitar ironing board. And uh, it looks like he, he looks like he was at a rush show recently. He's got a bunch of laundry machines in the back. Anyway, you just take your scissors, and uh, I'm actually just going to tear this out in the begin with, because it's a lot easier to just tear the page right out, and it'll come out in a, basically in a straight line. And for me. I'm just going to focus in on the side of these washing machines here because I have some laundry to do later and this is going to remind me that I have some laundry to do. So get as detailed as you want on this, but remember it's going to be a collage so a lot of these edges are going to be covered anyway. So I'm just going to come in here and go straight down. I don't really want, to want the words in there, so I'm probably going to cut up under this thing here that he's standing on. And then, you know, maybe go out here a little bit. And later in the collage, I'll cover up those words with something else. I'm just going to cut up the side here again. And I'm going to top it off right here with these, uh, uh, with these dryers, these washing machines. Uh, I want to make sure I get the top of this ironing board here. All right, there you go. I'll move all this scrap out of the way. And then uh, since it's a collage, we want more than one. So I'm going to take this motorcycle photo right here. And again, I'm just going to tear out the original page. Move the magazine away. And I'm going to kind of just, just cut around the, uh, the motorcycle here. Um, don't worry too much about these words. This guy's flying through the air. You don't want to try this at home. It looks like he's a little... He's a little dangerous here. He's flying through the air. And it looks like down here in this part, they did some, uh, some watercolor. Maybe they used some Epsom salts to, to get that snow look. But anyway, you just want to cut right around. I'm, I'm doing it a little bit rough here because I just want to give you guys any idea. Now, this is another place where you can also, you know, give him a little cosmetic surgery. Like, I didn't like how far his elbow stuck out there, so I just cut it, like, right off. You can see there, there's a little piece of his elbow still on the scrap part. It looked kind of deformed, so it could have been like a tumor or something, and now it's gone. So I basically just saved this guy's life. Uh, and he's flying through the air on a motorcycle, so that may not be very long. But anyway, I'm just going to zip along here, and you get the general idea. Be as detailed or as not as you want. I'm not going to go too much detail, and I'm just going to finish up with this tire here. And then we'll be done. All right, so for now, we're just going to stick with these two. And you want to have maybe a sheet of poster paper or something. And before you get the glue out, you want to arrange all of your images. So in this case, we're going to say that he is, uh, I don't know, maybe he's jumping right over here into the air guitar playing guy. So we'll put the tire maybe a little bit underneath this. Maybe he's a giant. He's going behind the stage. They're, they're at a stage show together. Who knows? We just play with it and find an arrangement that you like. Maybe he's jumping over the, uh, the air guitar guy. But when you find the arrangement that you ultimately like, grab your glue stick, like the one we have right here, and don't use too much because it gets kind of smeary. But figure out, okay, so this is where we want this placed. I would just put it right in the center and smear a little glue on it there. And place it where you wanted it to go and just press down for a little bit because these glue sticks don't hold that well unless you really apply some pressure to whatever it is you're doing. And then grab your other, your other piece here. And remember I wanted to cover up these words so maybe I'm just going to put the tire right over the words here. And we know we want it right about there so just smear a little bit of glue there with your glue stick. And again remember to apply a little pressure. You do this another 40, 50 times, and you can fill up the entire poster board, and you got yourself a nice wall-hanging montage.
All right, so that is probably one of the best things that you can do with a magazine. Uh, kind of, it's kind of like recycling it because you're getting a second use out of it. Um, real easy to do if you got some spare time, you're a little bored, and you don't want to just throw it away. A little bit of collage wall art for you. Thanks for watching.